are in listen only mode. Hi everyone, this is Barb Bruno. I want to welcome all my friends at TempNet to this conference. And uh, I had discussed uh, this topic a little bit when I was at the conference about what do we do with the candidates that we don't place. And I love this topic page. You know, when, when, you're, what, when your firm attracts candidates that we won't place, do the candidates sometimes feel like pulling their hair out? And I could speak probably for you and I as well, is this ends up being our greatest time waster. Individuals in, in the staffing and recruiting profession are really motivated by four things. I think we all want to make a difference. We all, all want to improve the lives of the people, you know, that we attract and that we represent. We do want to fill the assignments, the contracts, and the job orders with top talent. And, of course, we love the fact that we have unlimited income potential. But I've learned a lot by conducting weekly live webinar car calls for job seekers. And I've been doing this now for three years, and it has really been an education because they share many frustrations with me because they don't know who I am. So I get on these calls and I go, hi, welcome to this week's job seeker call. And what I've realized is 100% of the people that are attracted to your company expect you to find them a job. And currently, um, as an industry, the staffing and recruiting profession worldwide, we're placing less than 5%. So we basically disappoint 95% of the people that we attract, um, which is not, I mean, not a good statistic. According to Forbes and LinkedIn and CareerBuilder, the experience a candidate has with your company impacts their future buying decisions. And most individuals that you attract to your firm have had an experience with a recruiting firm, either positive or negative. And that, in, that experience does impact their impression of your company and also the buying decisions of your services. What I've realized, and, and again, by being in this business 30 years, is many candidates that we don't place in jobs end up as our future hiring authorities. And of course, they haven't had a good experience. So when we call and we're trying to get their business and we don't understand why they're guarded or they're not using us, part of the reason is they didn't have a, you know, a good experience when they worked with us. So, you know, why do we only place the 5% of the candidates we attract? Because everybody seems to think that's a very low percentage, but that has been the percentage for years. And it's because many candidates we attract don't have skills, experience. They don't have certifications. They're really the least placeable candidates. They have unrealistic expectations or major red flags. And in many instances, they're just outside your industry or your niche. They're not what your firm does. Um, however, 95% of your candidate flow you won't hire a place. They're the ones that call in most frequently for updates. Your average recruiter is spending 90 minutes a day taking calls from candidates they're never going to place. They expect you to find them a job. Um, they, they view you as sometimes their only lifeline to find a job. And that's the scary part, that they come to us, they don't do anything else, and they expect us to find them a job. So we become their lifeline. Um, they feel they have put their career in your hands. Unfortunately, these people often are our greatest time wasters, and they're extremely vocal when we don't provide results, especially when they say, can I call you? And we say yes, because we're trying to be nice, and then we eventually end up, you know, we don't take their calls because they're calling daily, and now they're just, now they're, just, now they're upset because they're wondering why we told them to call, but we're not getting back to them. In any type of relationship, people need to know three things, that they can trust you, that you care about them, and is you do what you say you're going to do. When you don't hire or place every candidate, their perception is that we failed at all three. On the other side of the discussion, our success depends to a great um, extent on our ability to just focus on the 5% of the candidates we will place. In fact, if your recruiting team only focused on that 5%, you would instantly increase your profits and sales. Your company's reputation, however, is depends on our ability to nurture and form lifelong relationships with everybody that contacts us for a job. Whether we help them or not, we want them to have a good experience um, because, again, we don't want them feeling badly about the fact that we didn't find them a job. If you provide any kind of results or resources to every candidate and make sure that they all have a positive experience, the result is you would increase your candidate referrals you would basically um, have positive posts on social media sites because now you've helped them. You would improve word of mouth advertising. You would form lifelong relationships and you would fill jobs faster. 
And if these people ever did become a hiring authority, they had a good experience with you because you didn't find them a job, but you provided them with something that helped them find a job. The question is, who has time to do this? There are not enough hours in our day to cover the open business, let alone help everybody that we attract. And this was the problem that I was facing. Um, I went into this business many years ago thinking that we helped unemployed people find jobs. I didn't even know the business I was going into. And then after 10 months and not making any money, I realized that my clients wanted people that were working. They wanted us to help people make their next career move. And so I'd like to offer you two solutions to this. You can create a resource that is going to help these individuals you won't place, or you consider setting up one of our career portals in less than 15 minutes. And I can tell you, this is by far one of the greatest resources for individuals needing a job. And I think this is one of the best things I've done for our profession. Because I don't know about you, but it always bothered me that the people that needed me the most, I could do nothing for. And so I want you to imagine just for a minute the priceless benefits of offering a resource that gives people a free resume builder. You don't have to do resumes for people that you're not going to place. There's a free resume builder. It gives them a career advisor that looks at their resume and actually preps them for what, you know, what hiring authorities are going to think of them. They get live weekly webinars that basically I do. And so I get on the phone every week and go, hi, welcome to this week's, this week's job seeker call. They think I work for you. They get weekly emails providing career advice. And there's a 15-step process that I've developed to help them find a job. I broke the job search down into um, a search, uh, I'm sorry, search and connect interview, um, I'm sorry, prepare, search and connect, and then interview are the three phases. And there's five steps in every phase. And it's basically teaching them what you and I know. There's also the Indeed job board in the career portal. And so every time they have a match on any of the 1,200 job boards in Indeed, they get an email from your career portal. So they think you're even watching the job boards on their behalf. In January, I'm launching a new version of the career portal where you're going to have the ability to list your job orders on um, the Job Seekers homepage. There'll be more customization. You can pick colors and put your own name and logo, but I'm going to give you more customization chances. You're going to be able to um, see the candidates that are registered on your site. Um, it will improve the user experience because we're going to have more videos in it. They're going to be able to register using LinkedIn or Facebook. It's going to have more detailed analytics so you can see exactly what they're doing. We are adding some additional paid services that the job seekers are asking for, and we're currently developing a, a free CRM for them to track their job search. And these are some of the things that they've been asking for. And so even though no one is really complaining, anytime they ask for things, if we hear you know, many requests, we'll start you know, upgrading the career portal. So imagine if your reality was that you help 100% of the candidates you, you attract the candidates think you created this resource for them because our name is nowhere to be found. You get increased referrals, improved word of mouth advertising, positive social media posts, and the call-ins from candidates you won't place stop. And that's where you put the 90 minutes back in the day of most of your recruiters. Our current career portal clients have shared the following with us after they set up a career portal. They have increased sales and profits and they've eliminated the greatest time waster. And those are the incoming calls from candidates that you're never going to place. And you and I both know who calls us the most. It's the candidates we're never going to place in a job. Additional results have been just happier candidates. They have a resource that helps them find a job, and your, your recruiters are happy because it improves their job satisfaction. They now can help 100% of the candidates they attract for the first time since they've been in our profession. Many of the job seekers who are currently using the resource to the career portal are people we would have normally all but ignored. If you're asked to speak at a job fair, I was just asked to speak at a job fair, and I gave them access to my career portal, and they were so grateful that I had this resource to offer. It didn't cost me a dime to offer it to them, and obviously I didn't have to take my job, my, my time going to a job fair. I just offered them this resource. And now our our Companies that own the career portal, they're receiving thank you notes and cookie bouquets and flowers and candy, but most importantly, increased referrals because people now are grateful. These people we all would, you know, we, we would ignore. Now they're grateful because they've been given this resource. So, you know, there's all these benefits you're going to um, experience, including this differentiates you from your competitors. 
you're going to attract new candidates with this career portal. Your existing clients are going to utilize this. My clients send the people they're not going to hire to my career portal. It generates passive income for you and it pays for itself. So even though um, I'm giving you a discount, a 40% discount in your investment is $5.99, if you use the career portal, you will generate more revenue than that. So literally, this, uh, it, this does not cost you a dime. If you want to view a career portal after this call, just register as a job seeker on the site below. The only thing is you have to use a correct email address. Like you could set up, you know, um, John Smith, you know, at gmail.com. You just have to use a correct e email address to see how this works. But a sample career portal is at www.myjobresources.com. And if you register there, you'll see how this works. You have three options. Um, you could do nothing, you know, and continue um, to only assist the 5% of the candidates you attract. You could develop your own site, which I have no problem doing that. You can look at mine, and if you want to create something like it, you know, um, I have no problem with you doing that. Um, obviously, it is time-consuming and expensive. Or you can set up one of our career portals, and in minutes, um, your candidates will thank you for, for providing them with an amazing resource. Now, obviously, I believe that option three is the best. I think this is one of the best things I've done for our profession because we have got to change what people are saying about us. You know, we disappoint most people that come to us for help. A positive candidate experience will continue to be a challenge, and you need to resolve this, especially in this candidate-driven market. And the Happy Candidates Career Portal guarantees a positive candidate experience. The good news for my friends at TempNet is I'm going to be offering a $400 discount. That's a 40% discount. The price of the career portals currently stands at $9.99. When we upgrade, you know, in the future, we're going to increase that price. But your price would never, your investment would never be more than $5.99 a year if you invest. So if you invest now, that $5.99 is the price you would have now and for as long as you have your firm. The interesting thing is um, we've had individuals that have come to us, you know, that that, you know, are, are like, we more than make up. The people that are actively using our career portal are getting checks every single month because all the services in the career portal are free, but if the candidate doesn't want to do their own resume or they don't want to load their, they, they want to update their LinkedIn profile or they don't want to do certain things, they're asking us for some of these paid services. And if they pay for anything, we pay the vendor that is providing the services and then we split the profit with you. So this generates passive income. So basically, yes, it's a $5.99 investment, but will you get your investment back? The answer is yes. Now, this offer is only good until Friday, um, September 28th. Um, to take advantage of the offer, you need to call our number because this offer is not on our site. The price on the site is $9.99. So if you'd like to take advantage of this, if you have any questions, please call Jody at the number below, 219-663-9609. And we would be glad to welcome you as one of our newest clients. And I can tell you that that we, once somebody sets up the career portal, they wonder what they did without it when they see all the benefits to it. And um, I think bottom line is owners were always looking to increase profits. And this has had a very positive impact on best use of time for especially your recruiting team. They're the ones that are bombarded by those incoming calls. What's your front desk person? When the recruiters say, I don't want to talk to them anymore, it's your poor front desk person that is fending off all these angry calls from candidates that don't understand why you're not helping them. So I would love to welcome you as my newest client. Again, I love TempNet. I thoroughly enjoyed speaking at your conference. And I would love to welcome you as our newest Happy Candidates clients. Uh, again, the number is 219-663-9609. You could ask for Jody, or if you have any questions, you can most certainly ask for me. Um, I look forward to hopefully welcoming you as our newest client. And I thank you for your time today.